Chris, tonight, the American Red Cross says there is an immediate need for blood and platelet donations. Plus, the Marquette County Suicide Prevention Alliance is hosting a Walk for Hope event this month to honor those lost to suicide and promote hope for those who are struggling. And Brookridge Heights and Marquette kicked off National Assisted Living Week with a tailgate-themed party. Good evening and thank you for joining us. I'm Brianna McLean. First tonight, a man convicted of bringing drugs to the Upper Peninsula will spend 15 years in prison for his crimes. Bradley Hurd was sentenced for possession with intent to distribute meth in the UP. The case started in 2023 